Hi, I'm Sebastian Jolin from Kitware and what I want to talk about in that video is visualization and data processing in the web. Let's get started with Preview. Preview is a distributed framework for big data. Preview can be driven by a web client for data processing and visualization. When we talk about Preview web, we tend to talk about the general purpose open source application or example application that we have, such as Preview Visualizer, which is technically similar UI as the Preview Qt application, but in a web environment. You can find your pipeline browser, the properties for changing on the filters, the representation and the view and so on. Then we've got the Preview Lite application, which is somewhat similar to Visualizer, but using a more modern framework, such as Vue.js with Vuetify, a more like nicer look and feel, um, dedicated UI control for fine tuning filters that have been handpicked, things like that. Then finally, we've got Preview DV, which is more like a data analytic types of um, visualization application, but that still leverage Preview for doing data processing on the server side and just like sending some summary information so histogram could be drawn on the client side mutual information um, 3d scatter plots so on and so on but the important part here is that preview web let you design your application the way you want let's take two examples from the commercial world let's pick sigma labs a partner of ours that is specialized in quality control on 3d printing and by 3D printing, I'm not talking about like the plastic melting type of 3D printing, but more like a laser melting titaniums in order to build like a 3D piece, a, a 3D metallic piece of something that could be in planes or anything else. So in that case, Sigma Lab is leveraging Preview for some of the visualization, but also so, uh, for some data processing to find regions of interest that may uh, present some anomalies or defects and we've got some illustration on the right side of some of the visualization that can be done using their tools leveraging preview and preview web under the cover then we've got data cloud data cloud is specialized in uh, mining and what they are doing is they are putting lots of sensors on the drilling machines um, that drills holes in, in the mine to actually figure out um, the density and, and some other property to figure out what is the actual um, ge geological structure underneath the ground. And by doing that, they, they get insights of uh, where they want to dig in order to um, get what they are looking for. And in the visualization that you can see on the right, so they have multiple views, they, they synchronize those views, they can uh, look at um, sensor data, simulated data, uh, extract or um, do some data processing to highlight the regions that may have like more um, density of the thing they are like looking for and so on and so on. But Really what you can see here is that those UI don't really look like uh, what Preview is doing and um, it really gives you plenty of opportunity to really focus on your data and your workflow. So to summarize, when you think about Preview Web, you should think about Preview, an open source framework that deals with data processing and visualization, then a web client that means a, a browser on, on the client side and the server somewhere that might allow you to define like a nice UI, a more modern way of interacting with your data and that lets you process and render your data without moving it. Meaning that if you're working in the cloud or targeting cloud infrastructure, you can have all your data hosted in the cloud without forcing the, the um, the web browser downloading the data or your customer downloading the data you can process and render them right um, right there you also that also lets you focus on your workflow and 
in that sense, Gitware can help. We can help you either through support contract that guide you in the in um, or guide your development team to create the software that you're looking for, or we can even do the development for you and transfer the knowledge to your development team down the road. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you. But in case you want to reach out to us, feel free to send us an email at kitware at kitware.com.